The Saints kicked off OTAs here at the Auctioner Sports Performance Center on Tuesday. Welcome into our Saints practice report. I'm Erin Summers. The Saints will hold 10 sessions of organized team activities over the next three weeks leading up to their mandatory camp June 13th through 15th. While OTAs are optional, there was high attendance in day one. I think today there's 80 of 89 out here, so roughly 90% of our roster is out here. Uh, these guys are working extremely hard to, to uh, both in the, in the weight room and now out here practicing football. So uh, we're excited about the guys that are here. Um, you know, we're, we're hopeful that we're going to still continue to get some more guys here. And, uh, but we're going we're gonna to focus on the guys that are here and, and, and get those guys better. And, New quarterback Derek Carr made his Saints practice debut, and in his first season, he's just getting used to the Saints terminology and the new colors. Yeah, I mean, it's, uh, it's a new new system, new words, um, a lot of similarities uh, to things that I grew up on and uh, that I believe in. And so um, it's still a learning curve, but it's not as big of a curve as, uh, as it could be in a different system or a different offense. And so um, me, uh, me today was just trying to have clean, clear communication, getting out, in and out of the huddle. Um, doing all the little things right and um, and so there's been a lot of hard work on doing that but it's just day one you know uh, we got more more work to do but it was a good start. A frequent target for Carr was tight end Foster Moreau. Moreau is participating in camp just two months after being diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma. Moreau is from right here in New Orleans. He attended LSU and he's really familiar with Derek Carr as they were teammates with the Raiders. It wasn't until I actually got here and I was actually doing like my second or third workout in this facility did I realize um, how much easier this was um, and how grateful I was to this great organization for, you know, I don't want to say taking a risk, but it is what it is. Um, I'm just, I'm blessed to be here and I'm happy to be a saint. After individual drills, the Saints did some special teams work and some 11 on 11, where running back Jamal Williams was RB1. Chris Olave, Rashid Shahid were the two top wide receivers, and Jawan Johnson, Foster Moreau, your tight ends. We'll have more coverage next week in the second round of OTAs. Make sure you stay tuned to NewOrleansSaints.com for complete coverage from week one.